the basket. Come on, let's go. Oh. <laughs> Dude, no way. Oh my god. What's up, everybody? Whoa. You know, you know what today is? Today is Wednesday. You know what tomorrow is? It's Thursday. I yeah, just didn't know if y'all knew that or not. Thursdays usually come after Wednesday. No, I'm just kidding. All right, so what's Thursday? What's Thursday? Why is it important? Well, this Thursday, me and my fiance will be going to Tallahassee. So, whoa, that snuck up quick. Uh, the whole Road to Tallahassee series. Oops. <laughs> um, I totally blew that. I was so busy uh, with prepping for tournaments. I played in the tournament every weekend for the past two months. And then last this, this past week was my son's spring break. So I spent every minute with him and put him in a tournament, which that's the little shot you've seen when uh, you guys first watch this video. Uh, he had a blast. I've had a blast. We've been going 100 miles an hour, and I just I need to stop, sit down, and say, Hi! Hi! How are you? Good. I, I've been good. Yeah? Is the snow thawing out? That's good news. Okay, okay. Now that we get that out of the way, let's, uh, let's do a quick update. Um, Tournament-wise, mentally prepared, my bag. I know you guys had a lot of questions. Would my bag be ready? Um, would this uh, would this switch affect me? I tell you what, I'm playing with more confidence than I've ever played with before. Um, and as far as my bag goes, give me a second. It's full. Oh, holy smokes! Yes, I still have the Ranger bag. Why? Well. It's expensive. Bags are expensive. And as much as I would love to have a Prodigy bag right now, this is what I got so far. And I tell you what, my bag is full, 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 full. And I even have backups. Thank you, Ryan Van at Foot Card Disc Golf. I have backups. I have. Let's see, I have another bag down here. Ooh. Yeah. We are. Uh, we're good. We're good. So. The worry about me not having the right discs, those are done. Um, the discs that I've been leaning on the most, let me dig out of here, is these two guys right here. These are the A2s. This is the SC Edition 300 Series Plastic. This is my favorite disc in my bag right now because I can do everything that my Cenus could do. I can do it with this disc and then some. Uh, what's the bonus of this disc is I can sidearm it up to 300 feet confidently. Like, I'm talking, I know I'm not gonna flip it over. And for a disc like this, I recently used it in fully at the tournament fully. That's what that is. And I was able to sidearm it on most holes people were throwing drivers on, but they would flash away. And the wonderful thing about this disc is, yes, it'll get a skip, but in that 300 series plastic it's going to hit and sit and that gave me an easy birdie so and all my upshots in the wind i threw it and it's been amazing so those are money um another couple of discs real quick i don't want to go too far into this because i'm gonna do an actual in the bag uh this guy right here and this guy right here. these two oops turn my monitor off these two the h1 and the 750 series M2. These guys, you take these three discs, and I think I can play any course I want and do pretty competitive on it. Very, very competitive on it, to be honest with you. Uh, the A2 is my first disc. The H1 is my sidearm. This is my Triple X Felon Firebird, that style disc. This is it. And what's beautiful about this that the other disc struggled for me. The only other disc that come close to this disc would the triple X. And what I mean by that is this disc won't get me in trouble by going too far. That's what I love about this disc the most. That I can put it on the lines that I want. I know it's not gonna go too far. So far, I beat it up pretty good. Um, this bad boy, I can rip into a decent sized wind and no, it's not going to flip over. It's a max, it's a 180 weight, and it's got that 750 plastic. It's hard, it's stiff, 
and it is dead nuts straight as long as you throw it flat. If you throw it with hyzer, you can throw it on hyzer. I love this disc. This is by far one of my favorite mids I've ever thrown. So that's cleared all that up. And as far as all of this good stuff, I'm my monitor up again. Ugh. So, so, the worry of if I had the discs is gone. I'm ready. I'm, I'm coming off of some of the highest rated rounds I've ever shot. And hell, I lost it. I lost the last tournament. I shot a 993 rated round, had a one shot lead. And I told my car at the beginning of the first round, I said, you know, everybody does it. What do you think is going to win? What do you think is going to win? I said, if I shoot 10 down on this course and one down on the back course, there should be no reason why I don't win. And I shot 10 down on the first course, missing five putts inside the circle for two. Mm, anyways, and shot one down in the back. And the one down in the back was not good enough. The guy shot nine down in the first round and shot a five down in the back, which was a 10-14 rated round. Whew. That was a dogfight, boys. That was, um, we shot so good battling it out that he would have finished first in open and I would have finished third in open. <laughs> oh, yeah. We, it was, he was, I think, 14 down. I was 11 down. And the next guy was four down or something. It, it was so silly it was really silly um you guys asking one of you i know one of you guys said wait you're not playing open no i'm not uh there's a reason for that i received my invite for the united states disc golf amateur championship and i've never accepted cash so i'm going to that in june but that's a whole other video we'll talk about that later so yeah that's just a quick update on what's been going on with my 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 trip to Tallahassee. I am I'm very 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 prepared. I'm really uh, excited and I'm ready to ready to knock it out. I'm ready to go do. I know what I got to do. I know the courses pretty well. Tom Brown is going to be a little different because, like I said, they just did a big remodel on it. I've only played it once. But since I have a most amazing fiance, we're going to go over there two days early and check them out. So I am stupid, 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 super excited and uh, I'm ready to go. So that's just a quick road to Tallahassee. This is the last one I'm going to do other than I am going to do a little bit of vlogging, vlogging while I'm over there, um, but not during the rounds, of course. And so you'll get one more video on what happened. But as far as the road to Tallahassee, this is it. This is it, boys. So yeah, that's the last video. Uh, do you guys have a do you guys have that one tournament a year that one that you just get amped up for all year and you're like I'm gonna this is my tournament I'm gonna do good this is my tournament this is my tournament I, I want to do good I, I got I'm gonna this is mm. you guys got that one tournament let me know in the comment section where is it when is it let me know um, and uh, yeah it's uh, I guess until uh, until after Tallahassee this series is uh, yeah that's it so until next time guys. Take it easy.